Hello everybody, this is Josh Spicer from GameWisdom.com. It's finally here. Darkest Dungeon is out. 1.0 was released on January 19th. And it's something to do why I've been waiting about a year for Hello, for a live play. Oh, one Spicer second here. Let's get that out. Sorry, I had Twitch running in the background. There you go, that's better. Okay. So, we are starting a live play of the Darkest Dungeon. See, we can go all the way to the end from start to finish. For those of you watching this recorded, I am still looking for uh, fresh and able bodies to name my characters after. So, if you'd like to be immortalized, all bit could be very briefly, definitely leave a comment below. This is going to be pretty much my pet project, I think, on Twitch for a while. We'll see how long it will take. Starting brand new one. Eh, we can get rid of Twitch run, I think. And my survival guide play. I'll leave that for uh, posterity, at least for the minute. Alright. I don't even know a catchy title. Eh, why not? Oh, didn't even save it. Come on. I know they've altered the beginning, I think. And they've also done even more bouncing with patch 1.0. They've also announced that the town events and the additional class, I think the merchant, will be added as part of a free expansion later in 2016. I just gotta wait for that initial load. Watch the game will stop working. That'll be my luck. Come on. Now, if, while we're waiting for this to load, I will be playing these videos a lot longer than my other plays. And this is gonna be just my general play of the Darkest Dungeon. So, be sure to bring a drink, because I'm sure these videos are gonna be going the distance. Alright. Yeah, yeah, thank you. There's our old friends, Dismas and Reynold. He's still a klepto, and he's still a known cheat. Alright, let's see what happens. Brigands have run up these lanes. Keep to the side path. The hamlet is just ahead. Let's see. Let's make things interesting. <laughs> Dispatch this thug in brutal fashion that all may hear of your arrival. <sighs> oh, mortality clarified first in a hit single is a freaking crit. Wow. Press this advantage, give them no quarter. These nightmarish creatures can be felled. They can be beaten. Yeah, yeah. Leave nothing unchecked. There is much to be found in forgotten oh, places. Oh, these messages. An ambush. Send these vermin a message. The rightful owner has returned, and their kind is no longer welcome. Okay. I think we'll do a track shot. Get this buff going. That's gonna probably cause bleed. No. Okay. He has a 50% chance to resist the stun. Uh, I gotta go for it. Ugh. Come on. Oh boy. This could hurt. 
Death oh. for the slightest lapse in concentration. Hit him, damn it. Thank As you. The fiend falls, a faint hope blossoms. I'm going more him. Oh, come on! You're not supposed to hit the other guy. Unbalanced. Oh, and he's bleeding. Oh, God. Impressive. We gotta end this fight now. Uh oh. Oh god. Oh this is no place for the weak or the fool. Hey, we got an achievement for it. Yay, good for us. Their cursed champion falls. Seize this momentum. Push on oh, to the my task's goodness. end. This is still trapped. Wow. Well, we already lost someone, folks. I think that is a good measurement of how this is going to go. Oh, Dismas, we hardly knew ye. Sigh. Welcome home. Ah, uh, man, down as the old is. road. This squalid hamlet, these corrupted lands. Uh, still, so much they are to yours do. Now, and you are bound to them. Yeah, yeah. Women and men, soldiers and outlaws. Oh, that's good. We at least get more people to start. All will find their way to us now that the uh, road is clear. Yeah. This graveyard is going to be filled very quickly, Most folks. Most will end up here, covered in the poisoned earth, awaiting merciful oblivion. In time, you will know the tragic extent of my failings. So I'm just trying to see if there's any, like, slowdown going on. Hmm, there's a little bit. I wonder if that's just optimization. Well, we really going to need a full party for this. All right, as always, we're going to raise the stagecoach network. Great heroes can be found even here, in the mud yeah. and rain. You're in. Who am I kidding? I need all these people, so... A sister of battle. Everyone, Bias get on. Oh, that's a bad one to get for a ranged character. Shoot, bandage, and pillage. The dancing steps of war. Okay, well, we can't really do anything right now. I don't know if anyone wants to watch the old cutscenes again. And we can't really do anything else at the moment. No trinkets. A mecca of madness and morbidity. Yeah, we'll get a protection soon, at least, Your just by completing begins. this. What sucks is that this party really needed the highwayman just to balance things out. Let's see, where can you go? So we can use judgment or divine grace. We can use illumination and hand of light. I know they've been rebalancing a lot of the classes, I think, with the 1.0 patch, so I will have to pay attention to see what they all do. So, Hand of Light now causes a negative 20% damage and negative 7 accuracy on enemies. Well, we're gonna have to see how that works. There's our friend, the Darkest Dungeon. Ah, it remains open. At uh, all times, apparently. But no one wants to go in there, obviously. 
The cost uh, of preparedness, measured now in gold, later in blood. Get rid of a torch. Mm, what do I need for the events? I don't need this. I'll take some just to cure bleeding if we get hit by it. Alright. He's still a damn klepto, which is gonna come back to haunt me. Thank you, game. Alright, well, looks pretty straightforward, but you never know. Okay. Well, we keep the torch above 75, he gets an attack bonus. Hmm. Yeah, the game is stuttering a little bit. I noticed this happened the when they did like the big last patch. So hopefully that will be fixed in a update quickly. Torch went down pretty quickly there. Since she can't do anything back there, you might as well just buff him. Attacks do all that much. Confidence surges as the enemy crumbles. Yeah, yeah, we know about corpses. Their formation is broken. Maintain the offensive. Okay. They've also changed how camping works. It's only a four battle buff now instead passage. of the entire dungeon. Alright. We'll keep things low, I think. Try to get some bonuses for gear. And loot, I mean. Chance of hitting, but it could cause blight. Eh. Lighter. Good. Alright, she's dead now once play takes over. So let's worry about you guys. They resisted. And this should get the kill on at least one of them. Press this advantage. Give them no quarter. Bye. Take a gamble. Very good crit heal. Oh, don't crit, don't crit, don't crit. Whew. And you can get a kill. Continue the onslaught. Destroy them all. Mm. Yeah, let's go for it. Explored 90% of the rooms, so we can go like that, I guess. Mm. 
These guys look different. Alright. Again, we can get Blight on her. It'll make her a whole lot easier to kill. Ugh. Now, how much is this going to hit? Okay. Good. Fiend falls. A faint hope blossoms. Hmm, stones have protection now. Seven. He has a twenty five percent chance to resist stun. Front row with the plague doctor, unfortunately. Foolish horrors okay. brought low and driven into the mud. Not bad. And we got a scout. Let's see, you got a trap. Okay. We'll go back the way we came, hit this curio, and oh look, they tell you exactly what's in the rooms now. And there's something kind of a stuttering issue, I think. Could have been something introduced in the patch. Hopefully they will release something to fix that. a fight here. Alright, this is our most dangerous guy right there. I think I want to stun him if possible. Much better than his regular attack. Spent turn to heal. These nightmarish creatures can be felled. Okay. They can be beaten. Does holy water work on these things? Huh, it does. Not bad. Now they show you what the disarmory is right here. So we'll give it to And she failed. Mechanical hazards possessed by evil intent. Okay. We 
know there is a fight in here? No. Okay. So with this one, we technically win. He's gonna steal from me. Oh, you bastard. The match is struck. A blazing star is born. Okay. We're not done yet. This is probably our big stress threat right here. Stun him. Oh, damn. And he needs to be bladed to probably get him down. Uh, what do we want? Can I stun him? Maybe. Such a stress razor. Uh oh. Okay, we need to start working on these guys. Uh oh. Okay, at least kill that one. Quakes. This guy will be dead in the next turn. Can we get another stun maybe? Unfortunately. Oh. Plus twenty skills or uh, stun skills. But a chance. victory nonetheless. Hmm. We'll get that to him. Use our remaining key. And now we're done. You 
answered the letter. Now, like me, you are a part of this place. <laughs> the cobwebs have been dusted, the pews set straight. The Abbey calls to the faithful. Fresh kegs, cards, and curtained rooms promise solace to the weary and broken alike. I got some new classes here. To those oh, with a party. keen eye, gold gleams like a dagger's point. Still can't change skills, though. For this first episode, I'm not going to do too much with naming characters. I figure at this early stage, pretty much everyone is disposable. I think starting from episode 2 is when I'll go through my little spreadsheet of names and start incorporating the people who have left their names and want to be in. I'll put them in at that point. Alright, oh, it's so expensive at the start. Okay, let's see. Not bad. <laughs> Wants me to really go there, doesn't it? You're out, and you're out too, because you're about to crack. She's at the lunge, picking the face, and poison dart. What about you? Unfortunately, bleed doesn't work too well on these guys, so... I think it's better to move her in the back. Still use pick it to the face. Hmm. Shingo in position three. We're not doing too lucky with our party right now. Hmm. That moves forward. really want to take him right now. Solo moves for three. And then Finale goes back. Hmm. Don't want to take rain all again. I think this will have to do at least for the start. You know what the game could really use? Something similar to XCOM, where you can remove all trinkets off of characters. Just so you can quickly reapply them to someone else. You have this. That looks good. And he's gonna lower his speed a little bit, but the protection combined with him being able to mark himself, I think will help out a lot. They've changed also camping skills. Let me take a look at that quickly. So, removes target bleeding, all companions heal. Removes target disease. Self is a supply item. One companion accuracy and dodge. 
Let's see. As you can see, there is now one that you can now prevent ambushes. As for you. So now you have to be a little bit more careful with how you time when you go camping because of this. Alright, we're going back to the weld. And now characters will also bring in goods of their own to save you money. Uh, let me see. We need a torch. That's a good old phone ring. One second while I close the door. There we go. Uh, I'm going to travel a little later this time. We're still in the ruins. So I'll take a key. Got shovels. Holy water. And herb. Okay, I think that should be good enough. Alright, let's see what happens. While we're waiting for things to load, as I Ooh, excuse me, as I said earlier, if you'd like to add your name, just leave a comment below and the class you would like to play. And starting from episode two, or day two, that's when I'll start adding these names the in. The must be driven back. And what better place to begin than the seat of our noble line? So we always have to go down here and make sure there's no room battle. Thank you. Alright, nothing here. So that means that the rest of the battles are going to be in this general direction. Okay. Good. Are they weak against blight? Uh, pick to the face should do the job. Oh. Press this advantage. Give them no quarter. Hmm. Their formation is broken. Maintain the offensive. Oh, that's good. Continue the onslaught. Destroy them all. Brought plenty of food. Alright, the confession booth. I think we can use holy water on it. Or we can go in and possibly get a positive quirk. Or get a bad one removed. Nice. Not the one I would rather get rid of sickly, but I'll take that. Alright. Alright, this is going to be a good case to use our mark. We need to get these guys going. Her blade does three around, so that would be nine damage on this guy. Oh, they resist it. This will lower accuracy and crit. Yeah. Dodge. Thank you. Yeah, it's time for a retribution. Or we stun. Stun and knockback. Hmm. Oh. 
And they're all up, so I think it's good to get retribution going. Impressive. Oh, two rounds now instead of one. Or I guess they count this round though. Do they? Fifteen again or no? Uh, twelve. Okay, so I get one more turn of being able to do this, so I'm going to push him back. Or stun, huh? Got one at least. dead now, for sure. Now he's really dead. This expedition at least promises success. Unlock box. So we only use a key. And we got a scalp. <clears throat> Alright, we know for sure we're gonna have to fight this. Oh, the Shambler. <laughs> oh, God. Do I even want to dare that with this party? <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, uh, well. I mean, this is a level one part. I mean, these are red shirts, so... Oh boy, is there anyone even in Twitch right now to ask? No. Okay. I am going to actually consider that. Let's see. 50, 60, 90. Thank you. If these next battles go by without a hitch, maybe I will attempt a shambler. Poison. Good. Okay, that she'll be he'll be dead in three turns. What's a higher accuracy? Come on. Now he'll be dead in one turn. Miss. Uh, which means I can now focus on these guys. Don't attack her, attack him. He wants you to attack him. Okay, he's dead. Great is the weapon that cuts on its own. Huh, this actually works out a little bit for us. What can I do from the second position? Again? Remind yourself that overconfidence is a slow can and pick insidious to the face. killer. And I can go backwards. Eh. Let's move her back. Oh, too far. Hoping for a crit. Uh oh. Dodge it, dodge it. Ugh. This is where we may get a whole lot of damage. Alright, we need to retribution this. Oh, why you miss? Okay. 
Okay. Oh, son of a... They're not targeting the guy who's marked. That is so not fair. Okay, this has to kill. Thank you. The light. The promise of safety. Why is his mark not working there? Precision. That's got to push him back. Thank you. healing her up. She's gonna take three. Can't do a pick to the face. Now the six. Hit him, hit oh. Oh, that's what I was worried about. Reeling about to break. I think I need to move her back into a healing hole. position. We know there's still another room to fight in. Even the cold stone seems bent on preventing passage. Okay. Can I heal with this? No, just a buff. Ooh, very close. <laughs> A hand's breadth from becoming unwound. This ain't good. Missing. Gotta kill that guy. Mortality clarified in a yeah, single strike. Good. Stop attacking her. Do as much as I will, boy. I still think these buffs seem to be a little stronger. Feels like you're wasting an action if you're buffing someone as opposed to healing or doing damage. Brought low and driven into the mud. I know this room is clear. I don't think we can do the Shambler, unfortunately, at this point. Unless I want everyone to die. Hmm, dodge it, at least. Alright. 
very lucky. I think it's more important to try to deal with these guys. Good. Why aren't they focusing on him? Is this bug or something? This is the last room. Uh, what's this? These nightmarish creatures can be felled. Uh, they can I'll probably be sell that, I think. Mm, yeah, might as well eat. Do we have one more scout? Oh, for the hell of it. Got the shovel. So bad. A trifling victory, but a victory nonetheless. Okay. <coughs> we have a chance of getting another positive quirk. Uh, well, she has a plus five virtue chance. I wonder if that will help us here. Nope, it won't. Yeah, I don't think we have in us to do a shambler right now. Room by room, hall by hall, we reclaim what is ours. Okay. Well, we survived. I guess that says something. family name once so well regarded okay. is now barely whispered aloud by decent folk. Make no mistake, we will face ever greater threats. Our All soldiers right. must be ready. The bellows blast once again. The forge stands First ready First thing we should probably do is upgrade the smith, I think. I forgot how much it's going to be slow in the start until we upgrade everything. Two and four. Let's see, anyone here? Oh, another seeker. Huh, not bad. That's pretty much the same skill set. Oh, a leper, finally. 
plus 4 speed, plus 10. Purge is the same. Stress heal on that. Alright, Bird Train, you're up. This man understands that adversity oh, that's good. and existence are one and the same. And I think we will get rid of him. So we can get another one. Wild eyes and a stumbling gait. This one is no more good to us. Everyone can get at least the first level. We might as well start Fan bumping flames, this up. Mold the metal. We are raising an army. Some may fall, but their knowledge lives on. Okay. More clovers dodge now. Let's go through all these skills again once they change everything up. Hmm, we seem to have a lot more money now than what I usually remember when we start out. Okay. Definitely need to upgrade some heals. Yeah, yeah, thank you. Let's see. With enough ale, maybe they can be inured against the horrors below. Okay, no, we don't want to go to the darkest dungeon yet. Plus 30% bleed, skill chance. Oh, not bad. Hmm, this would be good for the highway, man. We just need to get one. Now, as for her. We are going, we'll try the well, which means we're going to be dealing with a lot of plague-based enemies, so we'll need bleed. So, hmm, why aren't you coming out? There we go. Jester will go here. Anyone else I don't need at the moment? Hmm. I think we'll have to take her for the healing. <coughs> Bird train, probably not the most useful right now. I do want to get some more accuracy mods on him. All right, let's try it. Okay, bring some of these. Mm, and we only need holy water, I don't think. I'll switch my second drink here.
corruption has soaked the soil, sapping all good life from these groves. Let us burn out this evil. That's a horrible start. Confidence surges as the enemy crumbles. Continue the onslaught. Destroy them all. I forgot to give the new guy his trinkets, unfortunately. Lots of um, deep, so we can do some upgrading. Okay, nothing there, unfortunately. Nature herself, a victim to the spreading corruption, malformed with misintent. Okay, we can use medicinal herbs here. Get some extra food. Our percent 60, 50, 60. Our percent, might as well. Ambushed by foul invention. Okay. Could use the shovel here. Take a bit of a gamble, but why not? No, this room is clean. Buying a lot of good items. Man, the lay is really going down quick here. Do I want to take a gamble? Kill them, that's fine. Give them no quarter. Their formation is broken. Maintain the offensive. I don't think her battlefield cures bleed, unfortunately. Maybe we can just kill him. Nice. Sure that can be felled, they can be beaten. All right, we got the map. Let's see what's coming up. Oh, I gonna have to use a sh take a hit there, unfortunately. Uh, do I want to risk it? You know what? Let's go for it. If we survive, we'll get a huge amount of resources. Oh, we got the surprise. Perfect. Oh, 
you. Alright, not so bad. Very good. Success so clearly in view. Or is it merely a trick of the light? Oh, it's getting dark and scary. She loses damage when it gets too dark. give up anything here. Alright, I'll give the citrine. Ugh, man. One damn obstacle in the way. We're gonna get hurt here. Yep. With our tools of well, it wasn't horrible, we took a massive stress hit. An indefatigable purpose. All right, it's gambling time. But first, I will use my remaining food to top everyone off. For those of you watching this who have moved on from the survival guide, a quick lesson here, because I didn't do too much with the dark during the guide. The lower you make it, as you can see, we're going to take more damage, but we have a chance of giving more crits. And we'll get more loot. As you can see we've gone up point or I'm sorry, gone up two percent for our crit chance. May not seem like a lot, but that can come in real handy. Alright. Resist. Good. These guys have got to go. Because they will cause trouble if we don't get rid of them. How much? Darkness Ugh. closes in, haunting the hearts. All right, we need a crit men. here. Crit would be perfect. Ah! Oh. Does it make sense to mark? Good. Oh, we're black as pitch. Ouch. Oh, come on. Good. We'll get a really good reward, though. Nice. Very good. Remind yourself okay, we only need torches. Slow and only that. Killer. And we're not done yet. Eh. Cure it. Oh wait, I'm sorry. That's a cure. The medicinal herbs got rid of her debuff though. That's interesting to know. Well, let's get out of here. The agents of pestilence will yet be driven from our woods. Not bad. In time, you will know the tragic okay, the sanitarium is on walk now. That's great. See you in a week. She's a lot better. Uh, now we need 
portraits. Well, we'll send her a drink since she is our main healer. Can I upgrade this? Yeah, might as well. Alright, let's see. Ooh, we finally got an occultist. That's good. Colt is one of my favorites. Ah, they got almost everything that I like. Seeker. Mm, not bad. And a second occultist. Ability Hex or Abyssal Artillery. All right. Can I improve the barracks? Yeah. Word is traveling. Ambition is stirring in distant cities. We can use this. Hmm. He's got a pull. I'm gonna take. You know what? I can take them all to fight right now. the abyss, one must know it. I mean, at this point, we might as well just fill up on slots. What can we upgrade while we're waiting? Nothing there. You, nothing. We need portraits. Okay, sort by level. There we go. Really need to unlock that. That should be good. Now, we need to start looking into upgrades. Now, we're going to need portraits and deeds for that. Portraits are going to be in the Warrens, which we all have a quest. So that could be useful. Mm, not great. Hmm. Could be useful. Okay. I think with Stan should let him mark the leper, because the leper right now is a tank, but he doesn't seem to have any ability to mark himself. I was kind of surprised I didn't see any notes about him, about them altering the leper with the 1.0 patch. Hmm. Oh, I should... we'll take the disorienting blast. Place that with this. Put 
these on. And... And we'll take her along. I get this, I can put this on either the Vestal Occultist or anyone with heals just to give them a little extra. Oh, I should really put her in first position, there we go. I may take less torches. Take two of these. Hmm, I should really unlock their ability to cure blight and bleed. Okay, now we're ready. And since this party has two bladers, if we get a chance to do this shambler, I'm going to be stupid enough to attempt it. Okay. Good. Good. I'm really liking the mad arms as well. They're probably one of the few, like, really good tank classes in the game. And I think both the Leper and the Abomination kind of hurt the Leper's viability. Both the man, the man arms can tank, and he has multi-positional attacks. Abomination has just a wide variety of attacks. Leper doesn't really have much other than high health and high damage. But he can only hit two positions. And what better place to Ugh, this is a very horrible floor layout. Line. If we get lucky, we'll fight everything right here. If we don't, it's going to be a long trip back. Oh. Okay, this now does four. This guy is now going to die. One more hit will kill him. Oh, what is he going to do? I could stun. Let her go first, good. Confidence surges as the enemy crumbles. Really? Was this one health left? Of course. Good uh. heal. They have a fifty percent to resist. But, ah, oh boy, I'm going to risk it. Stun him, stun him, damn. Hey. Okay. Ouch. This one's dead. Destroy them. I do need to get some healing going though. Slowly, gently. He won't be able to do his quarrel shot anymore. But I do need to heal her up. Uh, I 
equip, equip battlefield mess, and we'll do this after this battle. This one's dead. Yep. Your death by inches. Got some food. Okay. Place this. There we go. May not seem like a lot, but every point will help us here. Grabbing the wrong one there. I think I was by accident. The way is lit. The path is clear. We require only the strength to follow it. Alright, books give us a chance of getting a positive quirk. Um here he has three. Two I'll let her. Damn. Eh, not horrible, I suppose. Oh, let's try it again. And nothing. Alright. I'm going to start to let my torch die out now. Okay. At least they're attacking the one with lower stress. Yeah, yeah. These two guys, and yeah, maybe we should start working on the front lines. Good. This guy is now dead for sure. She's about to hit the 100. Ooh, very close. Press this advantage. Give them no quarter. Their formation is broken. Mm, not bad. Maintain the offensive. A trifling okay. victory. Does but this work on the suit? No. Alright. Okay, she got a positive. Stress damage. Oh, we gotta keep going. Ambushed by foul invention. Oh. Can't do anything about that now. We're getting some good stuff though. acting on her own.
This guy's dead. And... Now he's surely dead. Yeah, he's dead for sure. The slow death. These two are stunned for this turn. Unforgiving. That was the quest. So Good. Too will resistance. There we go. Well, let's keep this pain train going, I suppose. We actually got really lucky. One more hunger event and I'll pull out. I guess we better. More bones return to rest. Devils remanded to their abyss. Not horrible. No Between the same though. world and that unplumbed dimension of delirium are tenuously thin here. Alright, we'll see her later. Mm, no. No. Ooh, bounty hunter, yes. Him. Oh, look at that. So now the marks take away protection. You see that was only on the Houndmaster. So her mark takes away dodge. His mark takes away protection. Okay, in that case... Drop you Slumped and take shoulders, the bounty hunter. Wild eyes and a stumbling gait. This one is no more good to us. Okay. really need stress relief right now. I guess she does. A little hope, however desperate, is never without worth.
the Occultist and the Bounty Hunter have some really good synergy, as well as with the Arbalist. They're all really great mark party. Along, probably, the four markers are Bounty Hunter, Occultist, Arbalist, and Hailmaster. The Occultist doesn't get any bonuses for marking, but he can mark them, which can synergize with the other three. Alright. Not bad. Give that to her. Hmm. What do we need right now? I think we need more of that. <coughs> Ooh. Okay. I can't use much blade here, but... This party stuns, and I can also do that. So this can work. And we'll take you for the last slot. Wait, can she stun? Yeah, I should really get Dazzling late, but we want to take this party. All right, let's try it. One, two, three, one, two, one, two, one. Hmm. All right. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, that's fine. We are at an hour and a half into this play. I think we have time for one more after this one for tonight. I figure an hour and a half, two hours should be good. And I still actually have to record my Binding of Isaac daily for today, too. It's been a very busy day. I knew all these paths. Ugh, once. This is an annoying one. Now they are as twisted as my own ambitions. Right, before we go for, I just want to make sure everyone has the skills that I want. Get rid of that. Put that one there. This is bad news for you guys. As the fiend falls, a faint hope blossoms. Confidence surges as the enemy crumbles. All right, do it, man. Press this advantage. Give them do no it. quarter. So we just gotta explore 100% of the rooms. Or 90%, my mistake. One down. We're gonna let our torch dip, I think, a little bit here. Because I really want to get some decent rewards. And this party has some decent synergies. I'm backing up because I don't want. <coughs> Ooh, excuse me, waste the shovel there. Why well, I'm gonna just get it from the other side. Give me a map. Oh well. It's getting dark and scary. Ugh. Okay, we got at least a small advantage here. I need to check one thing. Okay, that can be almost 
any of these three rows, so... Stun him. Good. Yeah, yeah. Now I can use finish him for very little damage. Come on, abyssal artillery. Good. I don't know what we just said, but I'm fine with that. I could push back, but I think we better get retribution going. Don't mark him. Go for him. Go for him. Good. Oh, good in the loose sense, I suppose. This actually does bleed now. Interesting. Mm. Mm. All right, let's go again. Continually nice. onslaught. Destroy them all. And I will try a. Uh, he's being protected. Mm. Uh oh. Uh, huh? This is why I took the occultist for healing. Concentration. what we needed. Be another stun. I'm not going to repair that because I think I can take the one hit. extra one, so I might as well use it now. Hmm, not bad. It's getting dark and spooky here. We got the map, so let's see. Okay, so this is an empty room. Hmm, not bad. Now, of course, if I let it hit zero, there's a chance we will get attacked by a shambler. Which, if you want to do that, you are free, but probably not the smartest thing to do. At least not right now with this part. Does that mark? No, blight. Good. Yeah, yeah. Cure that.
There we go. Be wary. Triumphant pride precipitates a dizzying fall. Thank you, game. <coughs> now, even though I scouted this, I still need to enter the room for it to count as being explored. Now, is this how I wanted the party? There we go. Okay. This is could be a very lucrative payday for us. And any of these brave souls hit level 2, maybe we'll do some naming tonight. We'll have a little naming ceremony. Uh, I can sell this stuff when we get back to camp. Other than that... What's one thing that I don't want at all? We'll just use the holy water. Gives us three rounds of resistances. The sack is empty. Oh. I hear the encroaching darkness around us right now. Here. Ideally, I want to hit everything to get maximum loot. Okay, I think we use the anti venom. Yeah. 250. Uh, nah, we'll let that one go. I could imagine, as a quick second, in terms of uh, strategic thinking. I could probably swap out like the man at arms for the Hellion, use her barbaric Yelp, and let that synergize with the Bounty Hunter. But I am liking this party. There seems to be some good combinations. Okay, we are at DEFCOM 1 in terms of dark. Found in the most tenebrous corners of this place. <laughs> Spooky, isn't it, folks? If I step out here, there's a good chance we'll get a Shambler. Which is actually... Uh, not the worst thing to happen. I mean, the Occultist is strong against Eldritch creatures. But I want to at least complete the quest before we start uh, toying with um, creatures from Beyond the Veil. More than enough food. We have a fight up ahead. I better take the anti venom because I think I may need that. If you run into anything like the uh, those mushroom things again. I hate to do it, but I think I'm going to get rid of this move charm. Oh. May indeed stalk these shadows, I thought we were the getting a shambler for a second. Gold. Oh boy. He needs to die. him. He'll cause some bleed. I can heal. Very nice. Not Eldred. I think I will mark. Oh. 
set him up for a bounty hunter attack next round. I do a regular hit, does 7 to 14. So there's a good chance we could kill. Good. As long as he hits, this should guarantee the kill. Oh, he's crying. A trifling victory. Mm. But a victory. We'll get rid of the Jade for 250. They want things to go that dark. Oh, hey, more Cowbell. Thanks for joining. Be sure to come back again. Um, as I said, for those of you who are watching this video later coming into the Twitch stream, I'll be playing Darkest Dungeon pretty much like every day for at least the next few weeks up until XCOM 2 comes out. Okay, we got the slimes. Shouldn't be too bad as long as I stop them from summoning their big brother here. The one problem with this part is I don't have AoE other than the Abyssal Artillery. They are considered Eldrake. Well struck. Wow. A singular strike. Two crits in a row. Don't summon anyone. Don't summon anyone. Whew. Yeah, from chat. I've been playing XCOM Aim within two on and off. I haven't dedicated like a stream to it or recordings just because I just find the game a little too stressful to play, although I'm playing a game that's about stress and dying right now, so what should I be saying? But I just don't think I'm good enough at XCOM Aim within two be an authority to talk about it while streaming, but As maybe someday I'll go back to it. So too will resistance. All right, one more. All right, do I attempt a shambler? Well, folks, what do you think? Should I do a? Sh should I um poke? The sleeping eldritch creature from another dimension. We all need shovels. Uh, let's go for it. I'm gonna give myself a little bit more food. The darkness holds much worse than mere trickery and boogeymen. I hear a dog yelping. Okay, we'll wander around a little bit. Surely he won't come. Do, 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 do. I the first time I fought the shambler, I actually beat him, but it was like a very by a slim margin. Do 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 do. do, do. Wandering around, taking in the sights. Oh, that's nice. I can at least see the traps now. 50, 60, 80. Get a little stress relief. Sounds like something's coming. Do -do 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 -do. Shambler, come out and play. I'm gonna have to probably take him and rest after this one. Oh, Shambler. What's his turn? Huh? 
nice. He's getting calm. <laughs> He's not showing up. That's rude. I hope you're enjoying the ambient, horrific noises that are coming in the background. Oh. Alright, we may have to call this if we get another hunger event. I mean, I am loaded for bear in terms of loot. Come on, man. Why is he not showing up? I haven't fought the Collector yet during in this new series. I've only fought him one time, and that was during the Survival Guy play. That went almost bad. Ugh. Oh. Packs full of steel yeah. and war. I'm gonna have to... Give him to the plow. Yeah, we're gonna have to call because I'm taking damage now from hunger. Oh well, I'm sure we will have more than enough time to run to the Shambler during this play. Decent rewards. He'll need to heal. Got some level... Oh, we have a level 2 finally. Okay, we are just under two hours in terms of this recording. In time, you oh, will know the what happened tragic to her? extent of my failings. Eh, okay, so she won't meditate. That's not the worst negative quirk to get, I suppose. Alright, one second. I want to check my little spreadsheet, see if anyone is worthy of being promoted. Where is that spreadsheet? I organize everyone who sent requests on Google Doc so I can see. Come on. There we go. Right now I got a few names, so Grey Robber, Arbalus. Uh so far no one for this particular party. At least in terms of we have someone at level two Vestal. No one's put their name in yet for that. But I'm sure we'll get a few as the series continues. Alright, before we go then it's time to make some preparations for next time. I already have two Arbalists, so I don't... Ooh, I really want a Highway, man. And one uh, percent off critical is not the worst negative quirk to get. So... Another Occultus. Nah, I'm, I'm happy with the one we have for right now. Can I even improve this? Yep. I think I'll drop my other Arbalist then, since she is level 1, almost level 2. Sorry, Vilhardin. Vilhardin? Make way for wild eyes a stumbling gait. This one is no more good to us. Okay. He gets that. Oh, man. Damn, I've been talking too much today. Alright, Drooks, I will give you... Huh. Did they change the skill? Tracking shot? No, they didn't. They could have. Grape shot blast. We have one. Two. I really want Duelist Advance, because then I can synergize with this. Or... 
can search out. Eh, it's good to keep give him a skill just in case. You never know. All right, Magnet, you need to rest up. You took a lot of hits there. Uh, what? Well, he's not going to. Oh, he won't meditate. Huh. Well, it's kind of this is kind of funny. We have three of his possible five quirks locked in, and they're all not like horrible quirks. I could actually leave that alone and just he'll only be able to gain two more negative quirks basically. Can I spend money here? We've got plenty of bus and crest for right now. A little hope, however desperate, yeah. is never without worth. Alright. We'll let him rest up. Everyone else is all right for right now, at least in this early stage. When we hit the veteran quest, then I gotta be a little bit more concerned. Meanwhile, can I do any upgrades here? Eh, we get level two armor. And she is ready for some upgrades. Dodge, we can upgrade that. Hmm. How's my bounty hunter? Yeah, we'll give him an upgrade. Get some more health. I really want to get this furnace upgrade more, but they've raised the cost of each upgrade dramatically to make it last longer compared to when it was early in the game. I'm sorry, early in early access. Yeah, we should probably give that to her. Right now I'm liking the Mad Arms, the Grave Robber, uh, my Occultist as always, and I don't know who will be number four. I do like the Houndmaster. The Abomination was pretty powerful. I know they nerfed him a touch with 1.0. Alright, so we need plenty of deeds, we need plenty of crests. Crests come from the cove. The cove is heavy bleed. Yeah, but not so much on blight, so Plague Doctor would be good there. Grey Robber would be good there. Hmm. Alright. Oh, and for those of you in Twitch, and tuning in on YouTube. So as you can see, the darkest dungeon is open in a sense. That here it is. In order to get there, we need a full level 6 party, I believe, to even unlock it. And it, from what I've seen, it is very, very difficult. Now, for next time. Arbalus, huh, that's not bad. Con oh. They've also went through yet another round of altering the trinkets. Oh yeah, I can sell some of these ones I don't need. Won't make a lot of money, but it beats having them around gathering dust. Oh, I should sort these guys yet again. Him. So I think for next time we may do this for that one, but we do need to head to the cove at some point. Yeah. All right. Yeah, we are going on two hours now. I think this is a very good time to stop. For those of you watching this either recorded or live, I did start a little bit earlier compared to some of my previous videos. I actually started at around 9 o'clock. I think for doing like these Darkest Dungeon plays, I'll keep to the regular time of like 9.30, 10 Eastern to start. As always, they will be uploaded to the Game Wisdom YouTube channel. This one should be uploaded probably like by like midnight or 1 o'clock in the morning for this for today obviously so we had a 
well, a decent start. Although I can't believe we actually lost a character on the tutorial quest at the beginning. I'm glad that's recorded because I guess that's some ad hilarity for this. Other than that, I think this play has really shown me just how much of a difference there is in terms of loot by lowering the torch. For those of you who watch all the survival guide plays, you notice I was very keen on keeping that torch level above 75 and more. This time I really went low and you could see that I was making almost double to triple the amount of gold and resources that I would have gotten otherwise. So I think I'm going to continue doing that when it's safe. Especially with these low-level party members, where I can get away with it since they are pretty disposable. So, for tonight, I'm going to wrap things up here. Again, if you would like to be a name of one of my characters, leave a comment. Let me know who you'd like to be, and I will make sure to uh, immortalize you at least briefly during our play. Other than that, thanks a lot for tuning in. If you've been enjoying this on YouTube and want to see more, please like and subscribe to the channel. It will help me out a lot. For those of you watching this on Twitch, if you want to get updated whenever I start a Twitch stream, be sure to subscribe there. Everybody, please check out Game-Wisdom.com for posts and podcasts relating to game design in the industry, as well as our ongoing Patreon campaign to secure some much-needed monthly funding. Find me on Patreon under Game Wisdom, and any donations will be greatly appreciated. And for the YouTube crowd, please shout out the Twitch stream most nights at 10 Eastern, but please keep in mind for these Darkest Dungeon plays, I may start a little bit earlier, and that is under GW Bicer. And again, if you'd like to subscribe to the Twitch to be alerted, by all means, uh, feel free to do that. So, our plan of attack next time, we will do some more Weld and Cove quests. Trying to get the necessary materials, I need to upgrade the Blacksmith and the Guild. Because those are the two big ones for metagame completion, and making it a lot easier to head into the mid and late game. Yeah, so we can get this upgraded. I'll be able to upgrade my heroes a lot cheaper, which means I'll be able to upgrade them more frequently, and thereby making the early game at least a little bit easier. We will need portraits at some point. I do want to upgrade people to rank 3. She can... Yeah, we can actually upgrade her at level 2. Ideally, before I even attempt Veteran Quest, which is the second stage, I want to get this to rank, uh, looks like rank 3 for everything. That way I can just upgrade everyone and try to give myself a little bit of an advantage. I also need more trinkets. And to start to balance things out, because the trinkets are the real key to high end play. Because you can only go so far with just the stats from upgrading your basic gear. But, I am getting ahead of myself. We still got who knows how many more days of plays until we see the end of this game. So, I am going to be taking off for tonight. Thanks again for tuning in, and I will see you all next time. Take care.